Hi, this is Stan McMichael, and I'm going to help you use Google My Maps. You're probably familiar with Google Maps, but this is Google My Maps. So this is a form I've created uh, with a simple question about location. It needs to be something with location, city, state, zip codes. Um, then I'm going to go over to my Google Drive, go to the New button, from the New button down to the More button, and then over to Google My Maps. Not Google Maps that you're probably using in your car, but Google My Maps. So you can create maps. So we're going to import the answers from that short form into a map. Think about book with a character as they're moving from place to place. Think about history, battles, all kind of locations, all kind of things dealing with time and location. So I'm going to hit the import button, which is right there. And then I'm going to go to my drive. And once in the drive, I like to use the recent button. It'll get me quickly to my form that I just created right there, map possibilities. Remember, that's a spreadsheet. And it's going to go and look for some columns in your spreadsheet where your forms from the answers from your form went to. And you're going to have to choose the form, choose the column. So just remember that when you're creating this, what do you want on this map? That's what needs to be in that. So you can see I have different things like time stamp, unnamed, but this is the what I want. I want the answer to this question. And then continue. And then this is the actual answer. So if you wanted the answers on your map, you would need to click that. So click the same two uh, columns on those questions. So as it loads, they're going to populate onto your map now. So here it comes. Think about uh, a book study with the characters as they move from place to place. And you can go into each location and you can add pictures, you can add video, you can add all types of things to each one. Like this is California. I could click on California. I can go here to the camera and I can add, uh, I can just go to my Google image search, click on California and search that and just take one of these images and you can quickly, maybe that's the image you want or maybe this image. Do select, you're going to see now that that's going to populate with that pin when it's save and now you can make a map going across the united states with different geographic locations like the grand canyon the possibilities are Im Im limitless and they are going to really give your kids a better uh, understanding of space time and actually when you say hey california hey this is what it looks like so this is google my maps so get in play around and see what you can come up with Thank you very much.